How's it going everybody? This is Hedgebeth here bringing you another YouTube video of me playing Castle Clash. Hope everyone has been doing good. Sorry I have not been uploading a lot. I think my last upload was maybe like a month ago or so. Uh, just been really busy with work and just haven't, I don't know, just haven't been really wanting to upload lately. But honestly guys, I think I'm going to get back into uh, to uploading videos. Um, they may not be... Uh, as many Castle Clash videos, um, if y'all could, you know, leave in the comments below, let me know if y'all want me to keep, up, like, uploading a bunch of Castle Clash videos. I'm not as big, as big as in, in the Castle Clash as I used to be. Um, a lot of y'all probably don't know, I can't remember if I told y'all in the last video, but I dropped my might. Okay, I consumed every legendary hero into pretty much my pumpkin duke whenever he was like a seven and nine I don't, he was like a seven nine or eighty nine but i consumed all my legendaries pretty much and uh it dropped me down to about i, don't, I think it was like thirty thousand might um but as you can tell <clears throat> i'm back to sixty four thousand might um and i have no spots available for any heroes except for one which i always keep one available just for you know slums and actually i think i got two yeah, I got yeah, I got two because I got the this S in here or not the S in the slime, but um, <clears throat> anyways, guys, I am back hopefully for good, and uh, I'm probably gonna be uploading a bunch of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare videos and also a new release of Black Ops Three is coming out pretty soon. I think within 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 this year, I think in November, I think that's when it comes out. But anyways, uh, till then I'm gonna be uploading probably a bunch a bunch of videos. I need to get me a new a new computer, a new setup, and all that other stuff. Also, I'll be uh. Even if, if I mean, if y'all want to watch, if y'all want to watch, I'll be even upload uh, day of the life videos of you know you'll be seeing me walk around, showing you stuff where I work at, things like that. But yeah, like I said, just leave it in the comments below and let me let me know what y'all think about that. But um, yeah, nothing really has much been going on. Let me show you my heroes. Uh, my druid here is level one eighty, maxed out. Of course, his uh, his skill energetic is only at five and nine, which I'm not really concerned about that. Um, but yeah, I got my druid one eighty, pump duke one eighty, nine on. I'm just going to give you a little run-through of all my heroes, just so y'all can see what I'm working with now. My Multanica, of course. I don't know if I was the first one ever to get my level 180 Multanica. Uh, but I know that I was the first one to make a video about it. A level 180 Multanica. And as far as I know of, I was the first one to ever get level 180 Multanica. So, uh, until I find out otherwise, I'm going to keep that achievement of mine. That Hedgepath got... The first level 180 Multanica. Anyways, uh, moving on to keep it. This is going to be the next level 180. I'm just taking one hero at a time to 180. Um, level 176. He's at 99. Keep it zero. Um, then you got my Ares. I don't really use him as much anymore. And I don't even really do the Lost Realm. He's the only reason... That, like, Ares is the only hero really that's important. I mean, all your heroes are important. But you need Ares, Ares in Lost Realm. Especially for the Deflect Boss and things like that. But I don't really play with him as much. Uh, that's him, 173. Quartet, 163. Definitely don't use him anymore because I got Vlad here. And Vlad, to me, in my opinion, is a lot better than Mortep. Oh, God, I hate to admit that because I love freaking Mortep so much. But it's the truth, and you can't hide the truth, you know. So um, then my next hero, the Destroyer. This is one of my favorite heroes. I, I love using him. He literally obliterates everything, especially with his 7 and 9 devastation. It He takes out everything. I love it. And I got, I got a 4 or 5 revive on that. So that's him. Uh, got my Reaper here, 161. Used to love using him, but of course, new heroes came out and he got replaced instantly. Uh, Thunder God, same results as my uh, Reaper. I used to love him, but not anymore. Here's my Vlad. I need to get his Blood Banquet up a little bit more, but i um, been focusing on my other heroes, try, like my 180 heroes, trying to get them to uh, 99 skills first. Uh, let's see. Then I got the Santa Boom. He's in my rotation. Uh, 157, 59 Fireworks. Uh, and then my Minnow, 141. As you can tell, I don't use him anymore. Who else? Uh, that's pretty much the gist of my heroes. Like, I mean, I got Pixie, you know, but lost, again, Lost Rim. Um, here's the, all my heroes, pretty much all of them, uh, 80, I got another Multanica here, uh, what else, what else, what else, Pixies, Pixies, we got the, the new Siren hero, the latest hero here, uh, nothing really, nothing really, you know, 
that stands out. I don't I don't guess. I mean, I got my basic heroes, uh, but they're 180, and they all have 99s pretty much. So, I mean, that's pretty much all I have. Uh, my shards here, I'm seeing up. I got 22,000 shards. I am going to throw them all on my destroyer here to make him a 99, but I just got the news that they're going to be having an update. Bring your skill set to 10. And now I'm second guessing what I want to do because Pumpkin Duke, 10 of 10, just looks, oh my god, it looks awesome, you know, but golly, you know how long it takes to get 9 of 9 and level 180? I've been playing this game for over a year and it's just, it takes forever. It only got freaking two heroes at that. But, uh, here's my, here's my setup here. I'm the basic death box here. Nothing special with that. I'm not doing any corner bases like you see everyone else doing over here. Like sex will be, I think, yep, yeah, little corner bases. I don't, I don't know. They can have their own little base here. I'm going with the the classic death box here. Uh, what am I moving around? Um, I'm just gonna do some here monsters. I can on it. I can do Q or R if I wanted to, but I don't. I'm, right now, I'm just trying to level up all my heroes, and I don't want to get them in. I don't want to have any garrisons because garrisons take XP. For some of you who don't know that, so. Uh, but I do have magic towers there just because if I ever want to put garrisons in there and try to beat higher heavy monsters, then I can do so. You don't really need magic towers, especially whenever you have heroes like mine with 99 skill sets. I mean, here monsters P is it's pretty simple. Um, the only way I'll lose at it is if Atlanta Core on uh, wave four and wave five proc, then, then obviously we lose because it proc deflects everything, but. If uh yeah if that don't happen then I'm you know I'm good but you know the chances that happen are like one in fifteen probably I would say but but yeah guys I'm sorry I'm trying my best to get some more uploads out there hope you hopefully y'all enjoy this video uh my phone let's see I dropped my phone uh about weeks ago shattered the screen so my whole entire face phone is like a spider web right now that pretty much sucks so I'm gonna be getting a new phone here shortly. Which I need to get, I'm gonna have to get my recordable, recordable app on there and all that, and Castle Clash and all that other stuff. But yeah, you just see Destroyer Proc right, right there. That's proc too, but I mean, freaking Destroyer Proc took out all the heroes. His proc is, is freaking heavy, just like the name of his skill. Let's see what we got here. We got Vlad over here taking out heroes, stunning them, and whatnot. Easy, easy, easy. Uh, but yeah, Guys, in the comments below, um, let me know what y'all what y'all want to see other than Castle Clash. You know, and we up, uh, uploading Castle Clash. You know, pretty re pretty. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Pretty on an everyday, but not every day, but every other day or so. I'm uploading Castle Clash. But I mean, if y'all want to see any challenges or uh, see what I do on an everyday basis, like at work or you know things like that, just let me know, um, and I'll get those. I'll get those updated for y'all. Don't forget to leave a like, and subscribe as well. That always helps me out. Get new content out there. Who's about to die over here? See what I'm talking about? Oh my god. god okay. Oh my god, man. Of course. The one time I freaking do a video. Let's see what his proc does. There goes half the squad. If he can get another proc in, let's see if he can do it. He's got to revive, so if he dies, he should come back to life. He should proc. That's everybody. Yep, he won that wave. Wave. You see that one v like five. He just took everyone out. But there ain't no way I'm gonna beat this last boss. So I might as well just end the battle here. The what? Look at the video. I lose. That's. I'm not even exaggerating, guys. I'd never lose that. Go ahead and use my XP books on. Keep it here because I'm trying to get him to 180. Um. Let's see. What else? What else is new? What else is new? Um. Our guild, if y'all are looking for a guild, we are ranked 276. We got 69 members. Every one of these members are very active. I love it. They're awesome members. Even though I haven't been as active lately, guys, I'm sorry. I mean, I get on I get on every day to do Hibri Monsters and whatnot, but other than that, I just, you know, kind of don't play as much. But um, we have some great vice leaders and great uh, guild members who step up to try to take the role of a vice leader, which is awesome. And I do appreciate that. It takes a lot of slack off of me. Y'all keep up the great work, guys. We got Truly Gifted here. It's a great guild. This guild's been around since day one, you know. At one point, we were like a top 50 guild. 
uh, and then we kind of just kind of started slacking and started, we started, started playing for fun, you know, we're not trying to get the, you know, the top guild now, we're just kind of all, all chilling, all in line chat, just talking, we're all good friends now, so they came out of it, we're a great guild, so if y'all want to come in here, join Twitch Truly Gifted, uh, we're looking uh, for 30,000 might, so 30,000 might or higher would be nice, uh, let's see what we got going on here, let's do some Let's do some hero trials here. We got Thunder God, which I'm probably not gonna be able to beat this either because Thunder God's just got a proc all over the place. I need magic towers for that, you know? With garrisons, but we shall see what's gonna happen. You never do. Obviously I don't want a proc, so this is this is good. This is looking kinda decent here. We'll see what happens. I need destroy the proc over here. Yep, there we go. That was yeah, that was simple. Luckily the, these corners over here where I'm touching at Luckily, there was a bunch of spawn in there, and they didn't need to just put them in proc, so that's always good. So there you go, just beat Thunder God, L12, and uh, uh, again, this P, P freaking here be monster with a fluke, so ignore that. That never freaking happens. Uh, bum, 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 bum. What else, guys? What else? What else? What else? I got to be for the video, guys. If y'all want to see more, more of this, please like and subscribe. Share the video. Um, my chat name is Hedgepeth, just like my Castle Clash name. Hit me up on there if you want to talk. I will respond. But uh, till next time, guys, I really appreciate y'all watching. And remember, drop in the comments box below what y'all want to see in the next video, what you would like to see as far as uh, in real life stuff, challenges, Castle Clash stuff, what games and whatnot like that. Just everybody, if you watch the video, I need everybody to let me know. Please, please, I really appreciate it. Till next time, guys, this is Hedgepath, and I will see y'all later. Peace.